This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Vanessa Villaforte with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. Does TikTok put young people at risk? Well, Nebraska's Attorney General joins others who want to know. They launched a nationwide investigation to see if the social media app poses mental health risks to children and teenagers. They'll look at whether TikTok violated consumer protection laws, and they'll also want to know if the company knew about any potential harms its popular app was causing to young people. TikTok said it limits its features by age and provides tool and resources for parents. Well, a study funded by the UK Health Security Agency found a booster of the Pfizer or Moderna vaccine increased protection back to levels seen after two doses. Researchers found the Pfizer vaccine's effectiveness fell from 65% to 8% six months after a second dose. Moderna's vaccine fell from 71% to 15. And the CDC says less than 50% of Americans eligible for boosters have actually received them. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist Chris Swain. The freezing mark overnight, down to 32 degrees. A cool start, yes, mainly cloudy skies. But watch temperatures take off into Friday. We're talking readings in the 70s by the time we get to the afternoon. Now it comes with some wind. In fact, the two go hand in hand. The winds out of the south warm us up quick. Then things turn active for the weekend. Rain chances work their way in late Friday into Saturday. And that could, with enough energy, produce a rumble of thunder or two. We could see some strong storms and uh, parts of our area could even see some severe storms. They're very conditional, but the potential's there. The snowflakes are mixing in there because on the back side of this system, we'll see a transition to a wintry mix. I don't expect much accumulation out of that system, but Sunday into Monday, a different story. You believe we're talking about 70s to snow in just a matter of days? Any snow accumulation looks to stay south of the metro at this point, but it's there. We'll have to watch it. 40s back on Tuesday, 50s on Wednesday, and then another snow chance into Thursday morning. But we'll get through this next system and keep an eye on the week ahead. A lot of changes in store.